Trance and Prosper. Hi, I'm Professor Brian David Phillips. I am your host and Game Master. Welcome to our second episode of Multiversal Mayhem. You inside our brand new campaign, Multiversal Trippers, when one universe ain't enough. Uh, this is using the awfully cheerful engine role-playing system, uh, very similar to the old Ghostbusters. Enjoying it a lot. Loving to see the sixes explode. Obviously, we have a couple house rules. And they don't get in the way of anything. They're just making it a little more fun for us and annoy the players. Yay! So let's take it away, me. And we're back. Uh, as you can see, we are currently in Multiversal Mayhem. Uh, we're in the room with a bunch of now dead bodies. Uh, including two incredibly damaged dinosaurs. We have a few rooms in front of us. Uh, so uh, we've got uh, two rooms on the north wall, two doors that are not opened, and two in the middle of the south wall. What does our team leader want to do? Yeah. Uh, we should check the dead body. They gather information. Okay, uh, Vanya, you wanted to spend a uh, a point, right? Yeah. I want to spend a, a karma point and have a flashback. Okay, so you're gonna take your karma. Do a little bit of LSD and have a flashback. Can you tell us, uh, spend your karma, uh, can you tell us what your uh, flashback is? Flashing back to when we were in the very first room and we were attacked by the scooby list gang and we took them all out. Um, and I remember that we actually looted their bodies and took their armor and weapons. <laughs> All right. Uh, if you want to carry their armor and weapons, um, you're going to what? You're going to drop one of your bits of gear? No, I'm going to stick it into the big bag of nothing. You have a big bag of nothing, and you want to stick their stuff in your big bag of nothing. Yes. Okay. Who else has, who else has that bag? Uh, only two people have a BBN. I got one. So we can do all stick things in. I mean, now on. And so then, then now we're in this room, and I pull out like a piece, uh, a suit of armor, and I go, Doxel, Doctor Axelrod, you're running around with that silly shield. Wouldn't it be better if you put on this armor? Okay, now the armor is uh, chain mail and there are only uh, the, the mysterious scooby list gang, they had only two of them were wearing, wearing soft or um, short chain and that was the two guys. Oh, okay, because it looked like they're all in plate armor or something like that. No, nah, no, nah, they, 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 they didn't have plate, they had chain. Loose chain chain mail. Probably too heavy for us. So, if Doctor Axelrod, Rod, sorry, Doctor <laughs> Axelrod wore the armor instead of the shield, does he get some kind of health bonus? Health bonus, no, but he like would get a defense stuff. bonus. And can he wear that, or that takes up a slot? Well, he's a pretty chubby guy. I was going to say, does it fit? Okay, yeah. actually. Is Dr. Axelrod a chubby guy? I yes. don't know. I don't he's, know. He's very he dedicated. Is. He runs Have you never seen St. Elsewhere? Well, he's, dedicated, he's a dedicated physician, but he doesn't necessarily take care of himself very well. Well, I would assume that everyone is reasonably fit, but they could be stocky 
as opposed to, I mean, no, none of the player characters are going to look like us. Uh, <laughs> no, it certainly won't look like me. Yeah. But uh, me, otherwise, you wouldn't be you wouldn't be rated to to do this. Uh, and I mean, certainly, if, if the, Dr. Axelrod doesn't can't wear the armor, I'm sure one of the security guys could wear it. I assume it's too big for Vanya. Vanya's not short. Yeah, it's it's going to be too big for a woman. Um, yeah, I mean, I, do I is what's the percentage of it? The Ooh, chance of it getting a, okay. Let's just say that uh, you reasonably fit people. It's a I mean a chainmail tunic, so it's not like right. it's uh, tight fitting. Um, so. Right. Let's just roll a roll a die, and if you hit a calamity die, it doesn't work. Okay. One d six. Make sure you're sharing your die rolls. I I have rolled a four. Oh, that's too bad because everyone knows that uh, in Mandarin, four means death. <laughs> <laughs> Dang it! It was deadly chainmail. Well, so sure. you, you heard Michael. Michael laughed so hard because that's true. Four no, is no, symbolic for death. Yeah, and so as, as you were saying it, I knew exactly what you were going to say. <laughs> but yeah. you didn't hit a calamity, so it sure. Plus four defense. Uh, no, it's going to give him a two. Two defense plus two. Okay. So that will put me at least temporarily to an eleven. Yes. So you'll okay. you'll you'll only die two less quickly. Yes. Alrighty. So, so then one person. Second suit of armor. And. Okay. So so what's his name? The. The skinny guy. Who's the, who's? I forgot the guy's Shaggy. Shaggy was skinny though, wasn't he? No, 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 no. These were not the Scooby guys. These were the okay. Scooby guys living in a world where they had to be buff. Uh, okay. Have you ever seen the comic book of uh, Scooby Doo, the Zombie World? No. Shaggy was buff. All right. So then yeah, we have like another the, suit the, of the, armor. The, the, the Scoob Apocalypse or whatever it was. Yes. Yes, well worth taking a look. It's it's a really good book. Yes, I mean there was a those the Hanna Barbera stuff that they did, Snaggletooth Chronicles and uh, and Jetsons and I mean I didn't read all of Flintstones and Scooby and Wacky Races. Um, they I thought they and, and Future Quest everything they did was great. Yeah, they they did in comics what the idiot Riverdale is trying to do in TV shows, but fails. Yes. In my Although opinion. Sabrina, yeah. Sabrina. Oh, Sabrina, good. yeah. Okay. Okay, well, hey, before, before we um, go through the next... Um, okay, but we didn't whatever. answer the question of does anyone else want to put on some loose yeah, chain? Yeah, we have now? another suit of armor. And so do one of the security guys want a suit of armor? Here we go. Oh. Anybody want to take the picture? It's only a weak uh, weak uh, fence. So, so like rod or horn? You don't want to put on the suit of armor? Yeah, I put it on. I don't care. Give me two points more. What the hell? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> okay. Yeah. All righty. So. Any of you guys have brawling? Want me to roll for it? Yes. Make sure six. you're sharing your roll. Yeah. A six. It fits perfectly. Yep. All right. So it fits really well. So you can be proud that you are the same size as Shaggy. I'm a buff shaggy. Yes. Can I, can I take, can I take this moment to go into the other room and retrieve my um, uh, multi portal? Okay, move your character. 
And remember okay. how, and, how this functions. And then uh, we also have four swords from the Scooby gang. Okay, but it, to carry the sword, With you're going to have to swap out. If you want to equip yeah. it, you're going to swap out a piece of equipment. Yeah, so I'm going to stick my multi wand into the big bag of nothing. Okay. Yeah, that's what I'm feeling. You can and you can stick like your your ammo and shit inside there too, if you want like other stuff. Is that like sticking a bag of holdings into a portable? Oh. Hole? <laughs> you can't do that. Well, don't worry, we're gonna get to that. Okay. Yeah, so, you mean like yeah, the multi wand? Uh, is your multi wand on or off? It's gonna, I'm gonna turn it off, of course. All right, so it won't receive it messages. Okay. Okay, so I will go through this door into the other room. Okay, you guys it's saw him go through. And he, it's an empty room, but it's. Is like, the multi portal still there? Uh, the multi portal is missing. It is missing. Okay. It looked like it was still on the uh, map. So, and now it's not. Well, okay. It disappeared. <laughs> so, okay. Wow. So, the, my multi portal is gone. I will okay. return. Okay. Dr. Axelrod. When yes. you looked into the empty room, you could see your multi portal. But then you oh. went into the empty room and the multi portal is missing. Oh, okay. Well, that could be a problem. Um, Only I to will you. Return, I will return to the room from whence I came and hope people and are still missing. in it. <laughs> okay, you and you go back and there they are. They're, they're there. And then when I look out the door, do I see my multi portal? Yes. Okay. Um, I will explain the phenomenon to the party that um, we can't go back from where we came. Something has, uh, I mean, these doors are functioning as portals. I'm wondering if every room in this place might not be in another reality or universe or however we want to describe it. But we're also out one multi portal. Yes. And you need to Axelrod needs to make sure that he he knows who his ride home is. Well, I mean, so far I'm assuming it's it's MacArthur. That's who I came in with. Yeah, but he might meet somebody. Okay. You never know. I All never right. know. Can you remove the oh, dead, dead body? Okay, the location of the dead body. Yes, and you wanted to search their dead bodies. So, uh, do I need to rose? Uh, did I find out some uh, more scientific information from the dead body? They're lizard people, yes. Uh, so, I need to find out the dinosaur from what... Uh, what age they came from, like the years, you know. Well, they seem to be whatever, this, whatever. whatever they look like. You mean, did they come from the Jurassic or the Triceratops? Uh, yeah, um, are they authentically that old or is a creation? They're authentically dead. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and, uh, when they were alive, so, yeah, they seemed to be... a magic, or it is really from the period. Mm. Okay, you can't, you don't know anything about magic, so good luck with that. Um, but uh, science, okay, let's do science. Uh, what's your, sci what's your, your science knowledge? Your brains? Uh, oh, not bad, four, I think. Yes, my number, my score is specifically not bad. Okay, but you, yeah, you can't use your electronics for that, so you use your smarts. Uh, gee, I wonder if you had a tricorder. Yeah, I have a tricorder. Uh, and what does, does that do? Let's note, uh, I can scan it, right? Mm -hmm. Yes, and what does your tricorder do? Oh, uh, 
Magic, it can do anything. Tricorders don't do magic. It gives you a plus two to your brains, your smarts rolls. You mean it, it gives you information, so you can do Yes, it. so you get a plus two, so instead of four, roll six die. You have my permission to roll a one on the first die. Oh no. Okay, so I'm gonna roll six. Okay, D six. Six. So did I get very, very good reading? Oh, Lorraine, go ahead and roll six sixes. Sit, roll six D six. Oh, so five more. Five yeah. more. Okay, nineteen. All right, so your total's 19, you only rolled one six, okay. If you'd roll three sixes, that's free, that's free karma points right there. Wouldn't, um, wouldn't she get one more roll? I, it, looked, it looked like she only rolled six. Oh yeah, I, I get a seven. Yeah. Why? Are you still doing the multiplier? Because oh yeah, it exploded, the exploding six, yes. 24, okay. 24. 24, your tricorder says that these both of these dinosaurs are between the ages of uh, 15 to 20. Mm -hmm. So they're, they're relatively young creatures. Mm -hmm. uh, and they seem to be um, the same age as the dead lizard people, as the slea stacks. Mm -hmm. So they're raised together. Yeah. together. Uh, you don't get a sense of uh, cloning technology. Okay, so it's magic. Why would you yeah. think it's magic? Because the world can do have magic because the, the you're lizard is you're... controlling the, the animals. Uh, the one that somebody killed, I don't know, uh, I wouldn't say that. I said the one that suddenly died. With a bullet in the head, yes. Gecko seemed to be controlling them, yes. But that could just... You you don't get a sense that he was using an actual external force. You get the sense of someone who controlled animals. It's like a, yeah. if uh, MacArthur told his pet Chihuahua to attack. Mm-hmm. So uh, I'm gonna scan Gecko and see what's you know what he's carrying or he, anything strange. Uh, he's got a glowing stick. A stick with oh, a. Oh, I already have that. Yes. I mean, okay. I, I'm there first. I already have the glowing stick. Okay. Mm -hmm. It is no longer glowing, but it does have the stuff on the end. It looks like a stick with a stone wrapped. In. Mounted on the end. Yeah, any symbol he carries, uh, his, like uh, just written into the stick. He's not wearing any chain or anything. No, 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 no. He's wearing a loincloth and a cloak. Oh. Like a cape. He's got a cool cape. The and others are just human. wearing loincloths. He look human. No, he looks like a slea stack. He looks like a humanoid lizard. It's like if geckos evolved into humanoid creatures, this is what they would look like. A big humanoid gecko. And they would so, sell us in a another timeline where evolution yes. happens differently. Possibly. You don't get a sense that they belong with these furnishings. These furnishings seem more modern than than their tech would assume. Okay. Uh, Can I read the writing on the, the wand with my multi-translator? No. But he was reading the books. What books? Isn't that like he, he got some books somewhere? No. Oh, okay. He wasn't he wasn't looking at documents and there there were he had they had runes that was documents in the other room that I wasn't in so I can't know. 
I don't okay. think he. I think he I did in the other room, but in this room, he never made it up to. Meanwhile, Thor. Yes. MacArthur, what do you do? My turn. Sure. Yes. All right. Um, there's still stuff in the box over there. Or they they grab it already. Which box? Uh, the one in the corner, beyond the dinosaur bone. By the okay, door. so the I bones in a box, yeah. Yeah, I was sent to get Is there that stuff box. in the box. Yeah, uh, so the doctor was supposed to get that, but he decided not to after he heard someone go boom. Ah, uh, if there's still stuff in the box, I will put it into my BBN. There is the stuff in the box. Are you putting the entire I box will... into your BBN? Um, will it fit? It'll be... It's easier if you just dump it. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. I'm just thinking the box is heavy. I could put more stuff in. Other stuff. Well, I don't have the okay. way of the box. Well, the, if, so I just want that's true. Okay. If the BBN can hold 23 items, does each crystal of the stuff count as an item? Yes. Is that a yes? Yes. So how many, how many crystals are in there? There are 15 crystals in there. If you I put, put it in the box, BBM, is that one but it puts the box. It's one item, yes. But it's still. But if you one. take, take the, one box, if you take all the stuff and wrap it in Gecko's cloak and tie it up, is that one item? <laughs> yes. Yeah. yeah. I uh, I ain't touching the Gecko. I'll just keep it in the box and put the box. Okay. <laughs> I will collect stuff. You put more stuff in the box. Is there room for more? Well, because I open this door and stuff on the table and in piles near the door. Yes. Or near the door we enter. Yes, there are random bits of the stuff all over the damn place. So the, am I uh, able to? Am I to open the door next to? Okay, if you want to, it, okay. Well, I'm sorry, you want to open that door? Are you sure about that? Yeah. It, do I still have time on my turn to open the door? Uh, yes, because it moves things forward. <laughs> and, and do you want to do initiative? When I use my scanner, is there stuff in those boxes? There's the stuff in the boxes. All right, I'll let the party know that here's a room, which is probably somewhere else. It's filled with stuff, but I don't really want to go in. Because I'm own. a coward. Because so I up. am not carrying a weapon. No, you I, want a sword, MacArthur? I go in. We have extra Scooby swords. So do you want a sword? I will go in. With, uh, okay, Rod, I'll yeah. Pick up the theater, okay. you have to Sorry, I didn't hear uh -oh. what you said. If I pick up a sword, i got to drop something. Yes. Unless you put it in your bag. Okay, Rod. Um, yep, I'm going. Okay, it's an empty room except for uh, it looks like five uh, Hello? Five cases uh, uh, that's look the like the, yeah, it looks like the same cases as the crystals. I'm going to ask I'm going to ask MacArthur if, if he can still see Rod. Yes. Yeah. Do I still see the man? MacArthur can still see Rod. He's just in I the doorway. See Rod. Mm -hmm. Yep. I go check the stuff just to make sure the boxes to make just to make sure it's just stuff. Okay. Okay. Uh, move your character to where you think you want to be. Check in the first box. Okay. So hmm. I want to gather all the extra random stuff. <laughs> Ooh. I'm gone, huh? Cool. Uh, hey guys, Rod disappeared. <laughs> oh, 
Can you hear him? Yell at him. No. Rock. I'm gonna use the communicator. I don't. I don't hear nothing. Yes, use the communicator. I'll use my communicator to see if I can hail Rod. Okay. Rod, can you hear me? Can I hear him? Look, we all have communicators. Let's all hail Rod. Okay, Scott, hail check Rod. your Facebook Messenger, hail please. Hail Rod. Hail Rod. All right, Scott, did you see the message? I'm reading it. Okay. <laughs> I thought I was... Okay. Okay, so... Um, having read the message, Scott... Or not Scott, I'm sorry. Uh, Rod. Rod reappears. Uh, there's nothing in there, guys. Wait a minute, wait a minute. Uh, Arthur, why don't you come in here? Let me show you something. Who, who, who are you calling in? I guess MacArthur or Arthur? The guy who's next to me. So you're going you in? in? Sure. Hi. Okay. Hold I on will. to your hat. I'm sorry? How, how would I do this? Message you or what? Just talk on the tricorder. Oh, okay, yeah, yeah. I got a bad feeling about this. Okay, MacArthur is. Oh, oh no, no, no problem. Okay, I'm sorry. I'm grabbing my notes here. The fish over here. Fish over there. Be a fish lost anywhere. Uh, you like the fish? Paul, uh, Paul, please uh, check your messages. So they just walk into the room without telling us? Oh, they, they no. Oh, no. no. Um, he, he said I'm going into the room. He did okay. say that. And he yelled out. Okay, Paul, have you read your message? Working it. Hold on. Nat, can you look through the doorway and see if you see them? Sure. Mm -hmm. Can I see them? Uh, yes. Rod and MacArthur are both right there in front of you. Ah, oh, they're just in the room. Yeah, they're okay. in the room. Well, they're they... in the room. There are five boxes. This is an interesting development. Okay. Get okay, in so... here, team leader. Yeah, uh, what's interesting? Don't know how to describe it, but I know with your brain, you can let us know what it really is. What does that mean? <laughs> okay, what's in the well, box? Team leader, I know you have the experience lately. Okay, are you going into the room? No, yeah, they haven't answered my question. What's inside the box? There's, uh, there's some really unusual stuff. It doesn't look like normal stuff. It's slightly iridescent in color rather than just the one solid color. Okay. You want to move it out here? I'm a, I want to put it in my bag, but I want you to see it uh, before it goes into the big bag of nothing. Uh, Juan, do you want to go check it out? Somebody moved my dinosaur. 
<laughs> I don't know. Dinosaurs keep moving. Yeah. I mean... I'm... Would I be able to, if I stood in the doorway, use my X gene scanner to determine if there has been any, um, like, you know, I mean, changes in their physical makeup due to their exposure to this unusual stuff or the room itself? That would be an interesting approach. Stand in the doorway, then. I will. And I will... I don't know what the range is on this scanner. It's a small room. I will, I will attempt to scan um, Rod right. and um, and MacArthur with my X-Gene scanner to see if I, if I notice any changes in readings um, from their baseline. Okay. And they're gone? Uh, something weird happened and... And? And? And I have to... Oh, there it is. Okay, sorry. It's okay. okay. What is so the room disappeared again? I'm assuming that the room that I can well, see they, in the room. Well, they both have X genes. Okay. They both have X genes. Mm -hmm. Okay. So from what I can tell from the readings of that scanner that they... They're still, I mean, their physical makeup hasn't been altered. At least in regard to the X gene. As regard to the X gene, that is correct. Okay. Uh, you okay. would need a more powerful scanner to tell anything more than that. And That's I, an I, X gene scanner. Yes. Uh, yeah. I, yes. I used my tricorder to scan the doorway. Uh, the doorway? Yeah. Okay, roll a D6. Six, mm -hmm. roll six, D6. That's one is three. Better oh, than a one. I got one six. Just roll all six. So I got an extra one. 25. Okay. Um, the door is a door and but you do notice some um, multiversal decay around the door and bleeding into the room uh it's like reality the the curtain between the worlds between the the verses is soft here for some reason so I'm going to share the information. Uh, it seems to be all the doorways are like this. There's another doorway like this in the other room. I, so I think we ought, we ought to open up the other doors. I'm expecting to another reality in and out. Okay, what are you going to do about the uh, boxes of the stuff? You're just going to leave it there? Are you going to pop it? or? Aren't we fools? All we are carrying. Well, you Can still you have a multiversal back? portal. Yeah, but it doesn't go back to where we, we came from. Doesn't it? Didn't we key code that in? Uh, it, aren't our portals programmed to take us to our point of origin? Normally, yes. Are they? I mean, that... You've used a portal before. Yeah. Yeah. It, it looks different. And you it's threw different. a whole bunch of stuff through there. Mm -hmm. Yes, we did. I don't remember the portals working exactly like that. And these doors seem to work really 
kind of a hopscotch manner. MacArthur, can you just, can you come out and let me examine you? Sure. I will come out too. Okay. All right. Then I'll, I'll use my, now does, does, a, does a medicine focus improve my role? You're, when, I, when I diagnose? When you diagnose, you're using, well, you're using the medicine focus. Yeah, that gives you six die instead of four. Okay, well then I'm going to, I'm going to ex examine them both. Okay, Scott. Yeah. Hey, doctor, I don't think you're going to get a good reading in here. Why don't we go to the room that other room over here and you get a better reading i am not interested in going anywhere let's just do this here and i'm gonna i'm gonna start my exam oh, no, really follow me okay so rod has left no he's still in the room he's just by the table i'm calling man these are shitty rolls okay really, come here Get a better reading on me. Nat, clear your dice, dice tray. Okay, so MacArthur, who didn't go anywhere, did I learn right. anything from my roll of a 13? Uh, no. He seems healthy. So. Okay. Thank goodness. At least the doors aren't like breaking us down or DNA or nothing. He, he doesn't, yeah. he does not seem to be a salt vampire. Okay. <laughs> hey, I'm It'd be like a, kind of a bitch if these doors started changing this. <laughs> well, team leader, what if we all start becoming like zombies. <laughs> I go through the door, Brian. Uh, you're in an empty room. The multi-portal is gone. Can we Come see Rod in. through the door? It's a net. And it's an empty the room. Back. The multi-portal's back. It's a net. The portal's here. Look. Uh, back. Come, to, come back to the room here. Are you where we came from? Yeah. In here. Right. So you can see the portal. Now you see he's in an empty room. Now he's gone, and now you're both gone. Oh, you need okay. to close the door. Okay. You don't need to close the door. No one can oh, okay. see you. Cool, cool, cool. You know what I do next. Okay. So that's what happened. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um. So when we walk through... We disappear when we walk back. We appear. Because yes. we're in a different time and place. Okay, and uh, there's something going on with Bobby Brady down there. Yeah. Um. Am I still in? Am I still in? Uh, okay, Lorraine, uh, check your uh, Facebook messages. Okay. Am I still Where are you in that new uh, close range to MacArthur? You're right next to me, man. Okay. I'm going yes. to I'm gonna surreptitiously reach in and grab one of my heel shot injectors and just jab the shit out of him. Really? <laughs> yes. Okay. You're going okay, to have to do I'm g i am I mean we're I'm 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 talking pulp fiction. Just just ram it right into his leg or his arm. I'll be like McCoy. I'll rip his sleeve for no reason and then and then press the hypodermic straight into his skin okay now he is a um he's an engineer so he's not security he's not um okay uh roll to attack and he's going to get a chance to dodge uh what the fuck actually rod i get a dodge hold on for your own good yeah, I'm dodging. Okay, roll to attack. 
Uh oh. Do I uh? Do I get the Keep rolling. What? Keep rolling, Axelrod. I just rolled three. He rolled one. Like my moves. My moves. That is... bastard just rolled one on me. My moves is three. Ah. All right. So what's your well, total? I acted against his will. Seven. Okay. Okay. <laughs> this is like. <laughs> okay. Uh, uh, so, uh, MacArthur, what was your defense? Yeah. What do I do? Well, we're just going to use like, the uh, his defense. Uh, your defense is 15. So, yeah. Axelrod. Plus, I got dodging, too. Yeah, that's what makes your defense 15. That's what makes your 15. So, that's what makes oh, okay. it so yeah. awesomely high. Okay. So, do I actually have to roll since he didn't even hit a 15? Okay. Um... Well, you have to roll to see if you roll the 1 2. You should at least roll 1 well, 6. Why would I roll out of 1 die. 2? So, am I rolling a 6 out of die? Uh, you don't I need to roll. You, 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 you're, you can't reach you can't. He, does, he doesn't die. have to roll a calamity die? Oh, you got a calamity? No, what I'm saying is that even though I rolled shitty, shouldn't he at least have to roll to see if he also suffered a calamity? Okay. He rolled a calamity. I did, Dr. yeah. Dr. Axel rolled a one. <laughs> so what'd you roll, MacArthur? Am I, okay. What do I need to roll there, uh, Brian? Six. All right, roll. Isn't, isn't your defense just like your AC in D and D? Yes. Defenders don't have to roll for their. Yeah, AC. you don't need to roll. Um, your. Oh shoot! Let me let me just do this. I did roll a three. One. All right. But it's not a slight medical thing. He's helping him. It's not a. Okay. Fire. Okay. No, Axel, I acted Axel against, right. against his interest, so it, this is fair. Axelrod. Yes. You held up the the injector and you stab at him so man in such a manly fashion, except he sneezed, his shoulder moved, his whole body kind of moves from the sneezing, your arm goes back, and you have just injected yourself. Yeah. <laughs> And so, um, the, yes, uh, so you, 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 you get, uh, go ahead and roll a D6. <laughs> so I've injected myself with three. So that, do I get three additional karma points? No, I'm no, 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 no. Uh, you get one health. One health, but if you had rolled a six, you would be full health. Isn't that what happened to McCoy at the end of forever? Yes. No, that's, that's just, you stabbed yourself. That's all. Okay. MacArthur, so, uh, Axelrod has tried to stab you and has done so. Rod, Axelrod, what did you say? What the hell? I, I think you're ill. You're ill. The, that Rod, room has affected you. Rod, you okay, what did you what did you say? What do you do? I will come Me? back into the room, yell to Horn, hey, something wrong with Nat, come and help me. What's wrong? You're asking you're Horn, talking to me, you know right? That's me? Uh, what's wrong with her? He fainted. I need some help. Drag her body in here. It doesn't work that way. You know how these doors work. I know how these doors me. work, and I'm not a medic. I'm not going to drag anyone. Go get the I medic. Need, I need you to help me drag her back in here. <laughs> hurry, How's hurry. security guard if you can't drag a body? Hurry, hurry, before something happens. I, I go back in the room. Okay, she's there. So I'm, I'm going to say to... To Axel Rod and MacArthur, like, what are you boys doing over here? What are you scuffling about? 
Mc, okay. McDonald's oh, I know. Is clearly <laughs> ill. I, oh, I'm is? fine. Just uh, stab me like he's been possessed or something. He looks normal to me. I, I, something's wrong. Something's terribly wrong with these guys. They've been infected by the room. Garthy, you're paranoid, yeah. schizophrenic or something. Yeah. I don't know. Go back out. Horn. Well, you're the one that attacked Please. me. Help me. I'm just standing here letting you examine me and you attack. Have Vanya go out there. She'll help you. And so I say, that's Rod. What's going on? Rod is yelling for help. We better go help Nat. <laughs> Dr. Axelrod, help me. Axelrod, come on, going. let's go help Nat. There is... Yeah, follow me, man. Yeah, come on in. You know so how I'm take care going, of things like this. I'm going to go help Nat. Yeah. And I'm going, Axelrod, come on. Doctor, we need your help. Uh, oh, this is I'm moving. not going. I'm not going. <laughs> I don't. I don't trust this. Something's seriously wrong with these guys. They've been infected by the room. What's what's going on? That we need we need to abort this mission. We need to go back. Vanya, you know what? I think Doctor Axelrod is right. We should go back. I think we should all go back. Just told you. <laughs> Everyone but those two, three need to go back. Those three are infected. We don't need to take their stuff back. Orn, let's get the hell out of here. <laughs> Have my wand and go back to where we came from. I just go back go out, like, man, come help me. I said I can't leave. I can't leave the the mission leader behind. Rod, let's go save her. Okay, you know what happened. Okay. I come in with my sword, though. Okay. I come well, do you know good, sword. pod person? So what happens when I go in this room? Check your messages. <laughs> Check your message. Now, everyone but uh, Dr. Axelrod and I checking their messages. What kind of... Oh, here it comes. That's just it? That's it. That's all that happens. Okay. Okay, so did we go back home? Not that I know of. Well, Pete used his... his did he? Uh, okay, hold yeah. on. Let me resolve this. Rod, uh, what happened? Okay. Um... Okay. Um All right, so Rod, you've got two unconscious bodies are in there. You're still, you're still up. Uh, let's see who else. Okay, so Horn, did you use your your trip sure device? You did. You have a multi portal or a multi wand? Wand. You have a wand. Okay, and you are you her. are you using it to to attempt to go home? Yes. Okay, are you carrying the stuff? No. Okay. No, we not. All right. Uh, gonna I'm need... riding with him. I'm riding with him. Okay, then you're going to need to roll. Okay, so first, uh, percentage dice for Horn. You want to roll uh, very low. You, you want, want to, to roll <laughs> like a tw no, not per that's a tw that's a twenty. Yeah, you want something yeah, there. roll your one hundred. Yeah, I need to find it again. Yeah. Okay, clear your tray. 
trying. I'm trying. You're only three. <laughs> I want. I need you to roll a one. You do not. Oh, I rolled a seventy-seven. <laughs> oh, that's, yes. That's too bad. Axelrod, your turn. Uh, you can roll a four. I will roll an eighty. Oh, that's too bad. Okay. <laughs> Whoops. Need to. Okay. Uh, MacArthur and Rod. Yes. Uh, Horn and Axelrod have disappeared, obviously having used their wands. Uh, Nat and Vanya are in distress. Um, what do you two do? Say, uh, Rod, I, I think they, they booked out of here. Are we buddies, right? Yes, you're buddies. I've got a, I've got I don't a, know. A Maybe you're not. I was going to say, hey, what? Rod, go to the other room and grab some equipment from the guys. Well, I've got a multi one of my own. Okay, but you need to grab, you need to pick one item from each person. <laughs> right. Hey, if he doesn't want to, and that's the thing I can do about it, I guess. I don't know what to do. The other two took off. So, what? Do you go well, after what? Them? What do we find upon our return to the coordinates? In, in a second, I need to okay. make sure these guys have done what they need to do. Okay, so do we need to go after the rod? What do you think? Uh, stop moving the damn dinosaurs. Okay, so Rod and MacArthur. Do you uh, go back to Nat and Vanya, who are unconscious? Uh, do you go to the room that panicked Axelrod? What do you do? Do we feel like we complete our mission? You feel like you've completed yours. I will go back to the room, the original room then. Okay. Go in. All right, you go into the that room. Okay. I'm all alone. What the hell? Okay, Rod, you're in the room, and uh, things are normal. Okay, but I don't know what happened to me, right? You don't know. Yeah, you have uh, temporary amnesia, I guess. Feels that way. I don't have... Then I come back out. Okay. There's MacArthur. You're missing... Uh, uh, Horn and Axelrod and uh, Vanya and Nat are all missing. I talked to MacArthur and say, hey, what's going on here? Where's everybody? Where is everybody? Uh, let me tell you. What did you tell me? <laughs> Wrong one, sorry. <laughs> if we keep moving a dinosaur. I didn't mean to move the dinosaur. Get rid of the dinosaurs. Or oh, lock them. Big gun in your hand. What? And why? Why you got that big gun in your hand and pointing it at me for? I don't have a weapon. Oh, you don't. Oh, this is gonna be easy then. I do. <laughs> no, that's just a picture. Okay. 
All okay. right, uh, I'm going to punch Rod in the face and <laughs> knock him out. <laughs> All right, you can try. What do we got to roll, Brian? Okay, yeah, you have, do you have brawling? Let's see, this is I MacArthur. have, uh, uh, okay, you've just got, okay, so moves. Uh, oh, this is punching. Yeah, three. Yeah, yeah. Uh, actually, bra brawn. Let's do brawn for punching. Uh, you have three. It's still three. No, no number one, four, four, two. Okay. Yeah, defense 14. So it looks like you missed. Uh, Rod, he tried to punch you, and because you're awesome, you dodged it. What do you do now? Oh, I will stun him. Oh, you have to roll to hit to that. That's... Okay, I got shooting four... One. Oh, damn. Uh oh. I heard that. <laughs> okay, you still have to finish the roll. Yeah, 13. Okay, 13. Oh, uh, oh wait a minute. Okay, yeah, roll another five. six. You had a six, so that's. Uh, roll again. Compound your calamity. Oh, roll I, again. I actually I wrote eight. I forgot. Sorry. Oh, this is going to hurt so much. It's going to hurt me. <laughs> 34. Got one more six. Okay. 35. Okay. At point blank range, <laughs> you miss. <laughs> yeah. And you blow a big hole through Fluffy. Oh. I mean, Blew a big hole through Fluffy, but okay. Yeah, this is you. Met, you you found another hole. Cool. Maybe it's a portal. Jump through. <laughs> yes. <laughs> mm. All right, MacArthur. Yes. He's shot at you and missed. No one else is here. It's my turn, right? Yeah, no one else is here. I want to resolve this first, so we can get through the dead bodies. I'm gonna pound on him some more. So on the defense, it's not just a number. It represents 11. Like for my defense of 11 represents 11 D6. No. No, it represents an average die roll of your moves for dodging. Okay. And All so right. you can opt to roll instead of taking the number. I'm with you. Okay. Okay. Uh, and hope that you, but it's a, it's essentially an average die roll for your yeah. dodging. Next to All right, exploding so, sixes, you got a twenty-five. Uh, and his uh, his defense is, you you hit him according to that, and your, where who is this? This is MacArthur, and so your yes. brawn is three, so you do one point damage. Yay. Okay, Rod, take one point of health off. Okay. And Rod's health is... He's in pain now. Okay. Okay, what do you... shoot him. Okay. Well, is this on kill or is this on stun? It's on stun. It's on stun. Okay. Okay. I didn't switch over, so... Got stun. Okay, All right. I will... His defense is 15, so. That two on the first row, so. Well, better than a one. So finish up Four three more. Fluffy. Oh, yeah, I'm sorry, right, six. Six. Uh, and he's got a 15, so. Okay, so I do damage. What's damage for stun? Okay, clear your tray, and it is, uh, I think 3D6. it's, uh, yeah. 3D6. Stun is 3d6, lethal is 2. 
can. Jesus, you dropped him. Uh, all right, so MacArthur, uh, can, can you withstand a loss of 10 health points? Um, no. So you're stunned. I only have five health. All right, so he's down. All right, now, Axelrod. Yes. And Horny Boy. Um, Need a file. If you prefer that. Go with what you say, it's one or the other. Yes. All right, you are back. Uh, you do seem to okay. You see the black mark at the bottom of the map. We'll just put you oh, there. I do, yes. Um, you're back but, where you started. It is not cold. It feels kind of tropicalish. It's very humid which is weird because it wasn't humid before. You don't see anyone. Uh, you don't see any boxes, but you are back in your staging area. Okay, so nothing, so we see nothing that would lead me to think that the stuff that I threw through my portal ended up here, or if it did, it's no longer here. Correct. So, and, and, so, I mean, do, can I, can I make just like a, can I just roll a general brains to try to draw a conclusion? Okay. Uh, you can roll a smarts. That's okay. four dice for you. Yeah, I got smarts and perception. Oh, yeah, do that. Because my die rolls are crap today. Um, I've got it. I rolled a 12. I'm just trying to figure out if this... I mean, it feels like that time is passing differently. Okay. Um, Horn, your perception is five, so roll five dice. And Axelrod, roll your four. One first. I did roll my four. I got a 12 total. I'm sorry. Okay. I already cleared my dice. Okay. Okay. All right. You're going to need higher than that. Okay. Okay, Horn, you've got two more. One, two, three, four, five. One you more. Roll one more because you have an exploding six. You need a 15, so you're going to make it anyway. There's another six, so... Roll again. Maybe Another you'll get six, a, uh, a superior look, insight. There you go. There you go. Man, Thirty-three. If All you right. Six pulses, you're going to get the third eye of Agamotto on your forehead. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he did. He. Uh, uh, pineal gland. Uh, so close. All righty. So you, uh, your insight is a little bit better than Axel Rod's. You have a very strong sense this is the wrong place. It doesn't Ooh. feel like your staging ground. And if you look at your multi-wand, you'll notice that the last digit in the coordinates is flashing. You also have a sense that the difference is not because of time dilation. Something else is wrong, throwing off your sensors. Uh. <laughs> that part we knew. You also has a sense that no one's been here for a while. So there's so there's no one here. We can't 
re-equip. We can't inform anybody that the party has run afoul of whatever um, whatever multiversal issues are facing yes. that area that we're in. I guess we can try going you back. Have a, you, you just have a sense that you, you have left at least two team meetings. Tim, uh, my English, you are good today. <laughs> team members in distress. Not really. My my hope, my hope to help the team has been dashed by Why would what we, we have found a sense here. If we did I, that. I, 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 since we clearly can can do nothing to improve their situation um, from being here. I guess we should go back. You guess you... Well, I mean, yeah. It's <laughs> obvious that we have to I'm do telling that to home. How? How are you going back? Can we not use the wand again? Well, First, we could, new but, but, but that, that last coordinate yeah. is flashing. Ah. Okay. Um, the, the last digit... For this coordinate, your home coordinate, Earth Prime, is flashing. Okay, so, so now you I, you have a couple functions I haven't explained on the portal and the wand. Okay, um, I don't remember. I don't have a portal. Okay, you used to. Uh, one is a home function, which sends you to Earth Prime right here. Yes. The other is a last entered coordinates function, or last, not entered coordinates, but last, uh, last known coordinate. coordinates. Last known coordinates, yes. Okay, well then I say we use it Basically, to go back. If I hit that button, we can go back. Yes. Yes. Maybe, you hope. We a hope. Little Google, yeah. We could go into a wall. We could. Yes. <laughs> you want to risk it? We, I feel an obligation to uh, to um, rend to um, deliver aid to our team members. Yeah, I mean yes, but it's obvious they're all gone loco and are attacking each other in other rooms or something. That's so some, something's careful. wrong. Right. So we'll we'll have to we'll we'll have to pull. We're, we're, um, McCready and the other guy in the thing. We're, we're the only ones who know we're okay. <laughs> Remember that 8,000 year old movie we were watching the other day with Donald yeah. Sutherland and the pod people? Yes. Um, if we go back to the room where the multi portal is, we can throw them through it. Yeah. Let's go back. Interesting. I think it will take us just to the one we were at, so we'll be in well, there. Yeah, we would take us hurt. would take us to where we were when we left. So I wouldn't get my multi portal. We just you've got a you've got a gun. I guess we need to be ready. Make sure I'm fully loaded. I'll make sure that puppy's turned on, and we'll zap back now that we have a bit of a plan. Okay. Okay. Uh, is your gun set for kill or stun? I think this time, with since it's our party members, we'll go for stun. Okay. Uh, clear your dice tray, and then roll a percentage die. You want to roll a one. No. Roll a one with a percentage die. You can roll a twenty-six. Okay, and Axelrod forty-eight. Oh, that sucked. Not really. Okay, you two pop back, and you see MacArthur on. MacArthur is on the ground, obviously stunned. And Rod is standing over him with his gun out. Uh, I'm, I'm putting handcuffs on him. I'm restraining him. You see Rod 
holster his gun and kneel down with handcuffs, which he doesn't Rod. have. Rod, what? Security guy. What yeah, the hell I'll... happened? Okay, you're just going to talk to the guy who... Me. I had to stun him. I don't know why he attacked me for it. Trying to punch the, me. Go ahead, put the handcuffs on him. That sounds like a good idea. <laughs> so, yeah, I, I, I don't know where everybody went. Don't I worry about it. Put, Everybody's put gone. Put the handcuffs on him. Calm down, Sparky. Put the handcuffs on him so he doesn't attack you again. I got handcuffs. Brian. I'm gonna go. To, I'm gonna go to uh, that door sh- and open not it. Not handcuffs, but uh, the uh, restraints. Sure, you got okay. zip ties. You watched a lot okay. of videos of the uh, January 6th thing, so you've got a bunch a of zip ties. Unless I'm with you, I zip tie him, and I tell him. You know, I already told him. I don't know what's going on. Okay, Axelrod, Fine. that's an empty room. You're it looking is, into an empty it room. It is empty. Well, you're looking um, into an empty room. Okay. Rod, when MacArthur is restrained, open the door to the other room and see if Vanya or Nat are inside it. Well, it's an empty room because you didn't go in. <laughs> Keeps moving fluffy around. So, the Which room are you talking about? The room right behind you. You want me to open it up? Yes, just open the door and look in. Tell me if you see anybody. Okay, I will open the door and look in. Uh, you don't see anyone. I don't see anybody. All right. I, I'm going to go through the door I'm facing in the hopes of... of Looking for, I'm, I'm, I'm going to look for our friends. I'm going to go through that door and hope I don't die. Yes. All right, move yourself. I mean, Horn, I mean, Horn, are you okay if I do that? I mean, do you think this is a good idea? Or does hell no mean anything to you? <laughs> <laughs> How about this? What the fuck are you thinking about? <laughs> okay, so what do we... Okay, so we've lost our leader. Who's in charge here? Obviously, the Secretary of State. Rod, are you taking charge of the party? No, oh, you are, Doc. You're higher ranked than I am. The Doc. I Rod, am? We're, we're, there is our leader, Rod. <laughs> he doesn't know. Okay, I'm going to go over to Axelrod and because he, he, I'm, I'm sorry. I'm going to go over to Rod, not Axelrod. <laughs> He's clearly suffering, you know, some sort of, uh, of amnesia. If he's not even able to recall the events of things before we how left. Do, okay. How do you know he doesn't remember? What's, what's Okay, you don't know where anyone is. Rod, what's the last thing you remember? I, was, I came out of this room. Everybody was gone. Then I got attacked by MacArthur. Martha, whatever his name is. <laughs> okay, he's Martha. he's restrained. Yes. He's restrained. Okay, I'm going, I'm going no to... Idea. I'm going to use a karma before. point. I'm going to use a karma point. To uh, um, uh, to try to uh, treat him and bring him back to consciousness. If you just wait five minutes, then he'll just come back to consciousness, anyways. Yeah. Is that so you don't is, is it always five minutes? minutes? Yeah, that's well, what unless the rule yeah, unless the story says something else. And I think okay. five minutes. So we're gonna pause there. I think five minutes have elapsed. So, uh, Nat. You are now conscious. Vanya, you are now conscious. I say, Nat, what happened? Did someone knock you out? Or do I, I don't feel know. hurt at I all? I did walk in and then uh, I lost conscious. 
Brian, do I feel hurt at all? Like uh, you feel like um, you feel like you you both feel uh, that um, weird. You feel like you've uh, you know in in basic training you would shoot each other with stun guns or tasers to see what it felt like. It feels like that. I you feel like you've been uh, shot. So with I'm, a, a I'm checking gun. my clothes to make sure that no one has been messing with them and to make sure that, that your, everything's in the right place. Your clothes are perfectly fine. Your, well, your, your boobs and other sense. pieces, your body parts are all in the right places. No one has done anything untoward. Uh, you're... You, you have all your equipment except for the uh, multi-translator. Nat, you notice your tripod might be missing. Did you drop it? Uh, I don't think so. Why, why would... My tricorder? Yes. It should be with me. No, it seems to be... You, you must have dropped it somewhere. Okay. Yeah, I don't think so. I think somebody stole it from me. I think that that Rod was doing something very suspicious. Like yeah. he told us to come in here, and then either he roofied me or he shot me. Uh huh. <laughs> but said so we better go back, <laughs> Nat, into the other room. Okay, sure we should, and ask what happened. You have to move your pieces yourself. Um, see. Uh, I'm going to tell Rod that you take my tricorder. Uh, Do we see them come in the room? Okay, they're no longer in the room. They're, they're back. Uh, and Matt ran straight over. She seems upset. I came from this room and I got attacked. I don't know what you guys are talking about. I haven't been anywhere other than this room here. We didn't like it. I'm so pointing what, my what, blaster at Rod and saying, Rod, where's my translator? It looks like you and it's not you? I'm down, everybody. I have no idea what you're talking about. It's just me. Yeah, I, Rod, stop lying. Where's my translator? Was gone and I got attacked. <laughs> Rod, stop the bullshit. You asked me to go to the room, and then you took my translator, and I, I don't know what else you did to my to boob room. when you were, I when I was in consciousness. Hey, hey, Vanya, Vanya, Rod, Rod, Vanya. <laughs> Pop. Obviously something weird is going on. We're probably possessed yeah, by demons. Yeah, Rod is trying to molest me or something in the other room. We're back together again. So let's be calm. Um... Um. <laughs> um that. Okay, uh, I'm going to politely ask, Rod, look at your pocket, see if you have my tricorder. Okay, I'll look. Obviously, I don't. Really? How about um, uh, Mug Arthur? He, um, he's restrained, he's on the floor. Coming to. Okay, someone look at his pocket, what he's carrying. Who's over there? Who's nearby? And I say, if you want us to calm down, Thorn, if you want us to calm down, Rod needs to put his gun down. He's doing something weird. And now he's I'm a security so, guy. So My Rod, job is to have a gun. Rod, you put your gun down. I don't trust you. You did something weird. I didn't do anything. Horn? I didn't come near you. In fact, you guys on me Horn? making me nervous. Horn? You see him. You like check you. your you messenger. Weird. I'm going to keep my guns up. So, Horn, Captain, oh, whoa, whoa, Matt, whoa. Rod needs to put his gun down until we know that he's on our side. Uh, Rod, there's no need to point gun at anybody at yeah, this point. Rod, put your gun down. Putting it down. 
You don't have to put that back we're on here. your belt, okay? We're not, not asking you to do anything. I'm not like pointing. That. You guys are acting weird here, man. Yeah, okay. Okay. I'm just being All I know, Rod, is you stole my translator. No, he didn't. Did not steal your translator. Okay. Look, show you. Here's my equipment. There's no. Okay, equipment. Horn, is that your roll? No, uh, yeah. clear your dice tray. Clear your dice tray and make your roll. This is my roll. You want another one? Uh, yeah, I don't want that roll. I want you to roll um, 5d6. Five or six? Five D six. In there? Five six sided die. Yeah. Roll a one first. Oh. Okay, you got two I sixes. Did not roll a one first. I rolled a six first. Okay, so roll another six. And another six. Oh no, just one more six. Yeah. Why? I had two sixes. The one left way, you have to live with it, or you can take the four off. I don't care. Okay, okay. Um, uh, hey, Horn, are you left or right handed? Right, you're right handed. Are you not anymore? Are you can <laughs> are you uh, comfortable using? <laughs> Uh, your weapon in your left hand? Absolutely. I'm great no matter what. Okay. <laughs> well, then um, it's really cool that you notice that MacArthur is very similar to you then uh, because his, uh, his uh, holster is now on the other side of his body. He doesn't. MacArthur is, um, he doesn't have a weapon. Oh, he doesn't have MacArthur doesn't have no, a no, blaster. MacArthur doesn't have a blaster. I have a weapon. No, oh shit! So you can't tell then. Forget it. Uh, you do notice that his buttons are opposite. So he was wearing a gentleman's shirt before. Now he's wearing a lady's shirt. So we don't we don't well, have a I'm used uniform to that from him anyway. Brian, we, the party does not have a standard uniform. No, no, this is only no. Horn just knows this. Yeah, this is just no, Horn. Knows. I was asking uh, in general. I wasn't uh, in asking general, this. you have different types of uniform to choose from, but you are absolutely uh, welcome to customize them. Okay. I just didn't know if, like, we were wearing, you know, company outfits. You, have, all... you can have your own flair. Got it. Okay. But at MacArthur? least 50 pieces of flair. Yes. <laughs> About yeah. MacArthur, him or herself. What do I perceive there? Just the clothes or thing? You, you, well, MacArthur is uh, unconscious at the moment. Uh, can we search his pocket and stuff and see if he got out? I will make sure everyone understands what I just am witnessing. Hmm. Have okay. you said anything about what you witnessed? Um, tell us I'm what trying. you thought. Okay. Hey, 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 everybody. I, I'm a keen observer of things. MacArthur's clothes are all reversed, like completely reversed. Like they're not reversed. Like you were looking at him in a mirror, reversed. So he's he's. This is a mirror, a, a mirror representation. <laughs> is some kind of a mirror representation of MacArthur. And then I'm going to look at the rest, especially Vanya, Rod, and uh, our, our leader, and see if they look that same oh, way. Oh, you would have to roll again. I will roll again. Yeah, he's got to him now. No, I would like you to roll again because it's more. it gives me better chances for you to roll a one. Didn't roll a one. I rolled <laughs> Not a percent hole. So. You have to roll D6, dude. Dude. Five, five D6. Calm down, calm down. Four first, nine. Uh, 
18. Oh, bummer. Okay, yeah, they seem normal. Which is weird because Rod shot somebody, but he seems normal. That's normal. And he may revert it back to normal. Is Rod still have his weapons? Rod, do you still have your weapon up? Or if you holstered your weapon? He holstered his weapon so he could. He holstered his weapon so he could uh, uh, restrain no, he MacArthur. His up and he was pointing yeah, it at, at us. Yeah, but then I got so, back up and they came on me, so I, I took my weapon back out. Oh, okay, okay. But I'm not pointing at anybody. I'm pointing towards the ground. I still have my weapon pointed towards Rod. Okay. So I, then I put my weapon I will, back uh, Daniel White, man. Rod, you you know you know that you know you've yeah. talked to me. I I don't want to be threatening. I just would you mind taking a look at your personal equipment to see if you're carrying the two items that they claim were missing. I already checked, and they already asked, and I am not carrying them. Not have them. Why would I have them? No, I have no idea. I just am trying to, to deduce why they are upset. So I think no, I know why they're upset. I have I no think idea that, why they're upset. They just came I think those two went into that room. mirror room and came back as mirror people and then started attacking people, which is why Vanya's upset. He's like, I just got attacked by these two. I can understand that. But it wasn't them, Vanya, that attacked you. It was their mirror people. Well, he's safe. So then, Arthur, then this maybe not. Arthur problem. is a mural person. And Correct. we should wake him up God and is normal. torture him God is normal. to tell us the truth. Hi, y'all. You are supposed to be the good guys. Good guys don't torture. They use enhanced interroga interrogation. Yeah, well, I will, I will say, as, like that. as a physician, it looks like to me that MacArthur is starting to come out of it. Yes. So let's give him a little bit is of space. There, is there any water inside or drinks inside this room? He on him. Oh, don't say that. I was scared I mean, of are that. There, are, are there any... Um, no, there's no water like faucet. Dining room. There's no water faucet. No, no, we said we search MacArthur, see what he's carrying. So did we find anything? You're we the lost? team leader. He has a big bag of nothing. What's inside this big bag of nothing? I'll back, I'll back away while Nat searches MacArthur. And Vanya pees on him. He no, put him on the table. Put put MacArthur on the table. You have to move him. Let's let's Rod move MacArthur onto the table here. I move him. And I'm gonna take like one of these dead guys' loincloth and wrap it around Rod's or her. Wrapped around uh, MacArthur's face. What? Okay. Bleh! Say what? Now you want to attack? MacArthur! I'm, I'm looking. There's no Tell water. Me. No one has, like, water. Vanya? Tell me how you're feeling. No, Anya? You want to keep it. Anya? Long time since I shot one of my yeah. party members. I might do it. <laughs> No, we have to ask him first, okay? Uh, so, did you find anything on him that's suspicious? No. And it's the just, bag he's, of nothing? He's got a what? bag of nothing, a multi... Um, uh, a what? A multi... Um, a bag from him. Scanner. Um, his stuff scanner, his con, his multi wand. And inside the back of nothing? Nothing. So all, those, empty? Uh, all that, that bag of stuff is gone. The box of stuff he had there is gone. Uh, that is correct. Okay. So, so he, had, he doesn't... Look, no, it look doesn't look like he has stuff. Is it like the correct settings and stuff that we have on our... Well, the buttons on. the buttons are off, but it's okay. It's the same as yours. It's just the buttons are reversed. Is that like a mirror multi wand? Oh, it is definitely. 
So if I hold it side by side to our multi wand, then this is not the MacArthur that we traveled to this area with. Something has happened when he went in to the other room. Yes. It's either a force within the room. We've seen that that Rod was able to to escape its effects. MacArthur clearly is still under the effects of the room after going in. Um, so this and is twice. We, I do not know what Rod did to reverse the um, effects of that room. I don't. Maybe it was just a time passage. Um, you know, we need to. Is is MacArthur conscious? Um, he seems to be groggy coming to so MacArthur tell us what you experienced in the room okay MacArthur you want to answer he looks like he's frozen I know oh there he is Disconnect. Watch. MacArthur, can you tell us what you experienced in the other room? Rod Axel, clearly doesn't Axel, remember. Axelrod tried to kill me with something, and then Rod shot me. I don't know what's going on. Why did the two of you attack me like that? You attacked me. You tried to... I didn't attack him when I don't have any weapons. Try to punch me out, man. Dr. Axelrod tried you. to kill me. <laughs> with some shot of something and then Rod shot me after they disappeared what the hell's going on what, what did you experience in the other room I went in the other room I saw the stuff there's some unusual stuff in there it's different color came back out because you asked me to come back out then you tried to attack me for some reason then you disappeared and then Rod shot me. <laughs> you attacked me. <laughs> All right, so, well, that, so MacArthur is tied up on this table. So I, I take out my sword and say, MacArthur, we're going to stop. I'll lock you guys. We're going to what? Lost him. Okay. Yeah. He kind of drifted off there. It's all frozen up. Ah, okay. What happened here? I think we just lost Michael. That's it. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah. He's gone. He'll hopefully pop back yeah. in. He's coming back. Because the gods are not going to allow torture and mayhem. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so what did you hear me say before? Yeah, please I don't. Before I, I don't I know what you say. Off. We didn't see. We didn't no, hear you. you. Okay, all I heard was you said something about kissing MacArthur and and then you disappeared. So I thought I he said point, fondling. Did he say kissing? I thought it was fondling. I point the sword point at his crotch and say, MacArthur, we know you're a fake mirror version. So start telling us the truth about what's going on or I start cutting. So is he going to say anything? No, we don't actually know he's a full-on fake mirror. He could be still the real person mirrorized. <laughs> could have mirrorized him. We don't know. Is MacArthur be going to reply? The pod people. He's frozen in fear. What do you want? Yeah, that's frozen fear. See? Barely move. Oh shit! What's what's happening? Okay, I need everyone to roll uh, a percentage dice. Percentage? You mean the one hundred percent one? Yes. Roll a percentile. Sixty percentage dice. Yeah. I got. I rolled a one. I got a hundred and nine. <laughs> okay, you want to roll really, really low. 
I did. I you rolled do. a one. You don't actually want to. You, you I got a ninety-six. A one on your percentage. No. You got a rock. Okay, lucky. Oh my god. You actually got sixteen. Wow. Wow. I got a nine. Oh, that's really close for you, cause you are. Oh wow. Oh wow. <laughs> Jesus. Okay, hold on. Let me. Uh... This is gonna be rough. What did Steven first get? A <laughs> nine. Oh. Didn't show up on mine. It didn't? It's it you gotta scroll oh, down. Scroll down. Scroll down. Yeah. Scroll all the way down, here's the last one. Oh yeah, yeah I see now. Now I can't see mine. Mine's yeah. better. It only shows so many. I feel like I'm missing like somebody. It. Who am I missing? Yeah, you my just scroll, and scroll up and down. Scroll up and down and you can get all the people. Yeah, everyone's there. 85, MacArthur's 96, Rod is 36, Nat is 16, Vanya 60. They're all there. Oh, there. It's all. Okay. I see now. Okay. So. All right. So you have this weird feeling. Uh, go ahead and clear your trays. Uh, and you have this a feeling of traveling through the multiverse. Feeling, feeling. And feeling. now you all appear back in your staging area. Including MacArthur? You are missing MacArthur. Mm. Why are we here for? Why are we back? Okay, the staging area is dark. It feels off. It'd be really nice if someone had a Kamife here. Oh. <laughs> yes. <laughs> <laughs> uh, you do see a light Horn. coming towards you. Horn, look at your wand and see if it's reading the same odd way that it was the last time we were here. We'll do exactly that. And uh, last time we were here, this is what we experienced, something similar. Okay. Um, who has who has a, um, a, a big bag of nothing? I do. Are you carrying the stuff? I have some stuff in a, a cloak, Gecko's cloak. Okay. And a light comes towards you, all of you. And there's Ted. What has happened? Ted. We lost contact with your coordinate uh, thingies. We couldn't track you. Uh, you, you. You got to the location we sent you to. And you seem to blip out. What happened? A company that deals in time uh, multiversaling, you must suck if you didn't know what happened. <laughs> yeah. uh, multiversaling. It's your job to tell us. It's your job to go to We've places trying, and Ed, find out. We were already here once to try to tell you, Ed. I believe the coordinates you sent us to are experiencing a multiversal erosion that has affected the party and has affected our ability to search for the stuff. I attempted... I am going to use my perception to glare at Ted and see if he's reversed mirror too. Okay, roll. Uh, roll a one Percentage for your first one. Six-sided. Six Roll your five six-sided die. Dude. Dude. Oh, that's sad. Uh, 
Did I get an extra one for my six? I can't tell. I, I don't see your full roll. There it is. 19? Yes, you yeah. get an extra yeah. for the six. Did already. 19 is the total. Okay. Uh, you, you perceive that Ted would not look that good with a goatee. Um, he seems to be like Ted. He's not a mere Ted. He's Ted Ted. Ted. So did you receive any of the boxes of stuff? Ah, that... you did that. I okay. did that. All right. Ted Ted. All right. So we yeah. got we got two boxes of the stuff through a portal hole which he immediately turned off for some reason. Uh, one of the boxes was actually only two-thirds through, and it was cut as the portal collapsed. Um, hmm. Don't do that again. How uh, do we if you, if you transport that, that much of the stuff in one place, it causes a nexus event and we suspect the coordinates we sent you to may be a nexus event oh uh, the portal is the stuff is very very sensitive stuff uh the stuff is sensitive the stuff and essentially, if you store too much of it together, it can cause, as you say, erosion in the walls. That and is clearly what we are experiencing because this place is lousy with the stuff. Now, don't get me wrong. We would perfectly like to have the stuff. And thanks to your good research here, we now know, uh, don't store too much of the stuff together or it could cause a nexus event and destroy life as we know it. So yes. thank you for that. Good job, guys. Well, one of our party members is still at the nexus event and we would like to go back for him. All right, uh, you want to gear up, uh, replenish any supplies? Yeah, we lost a tricorder. Wait, you lost it? You lost a tricorder? Yeah, someone took it that we couldn't find oh. it. Did you lose any Rod other equipment? Uh, the translator's also gone. Oh, you think Rod took it? Rod, where did you put it? You, did not they just—they just told me you took it. What are they lying? Can you not tell? We we well, also lost, lost a. We well, lost a. Lost I lost my multi portal. It was absorbed by the Nexus event. Yeah, it could be that. We don't know why. Do we need to go back and get this stuff? Yeah, how do we transport a lot of stuff if we can't put a lot of stuff together? Well, you, we you can transfer a, 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 a regular amount of it. Um, uh, like you have to, it, it has to be in, in bits. Okay. One box at a time? Pretty much, yeah. Okay. So, why well, you, you like may want to unload all the stuff yeah. you have. Yeah, I'm going to unload yeah. the stuff, and well, I also found got this wand from some lizard guy. Huh? MacArthur. That's the traitor. Can MacArthur's bad. Pete, do his clothes look the same? Who, Ted? Horn, yeah. no, Horn, take a look at MacArthur, he's back. Oh, MacArthur, yeah, is he back to normal clothes? Seems to be. You tell me, perception roller. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna roll perception. 
Is Horn? No. Is MacArthur? Apparently back to normal. Start with a four. We'll go all the way up to... Teen. 18. So, yes. He seems to be back to normal. Okay, so, Ted, um, you need to mark those coordinates as a place that's filled with stuff but dangerous to go to. I mean, maybe by the time you go back, the event may... You know, maybe it's just going to collapse upon itself. There may be... Maybe we just shouldn't go there at all. So I asked MacArthur, did anything get stolen from him? Okay, MacArthur, do you answer? Yes. I didn't hear that. Did anything get stolen from you? Um, it looks like someone took my wand. How'd you get back? I have no idea. So you don't remember anything that happened to you in... You have all the, your uh, stuff. MacArthur, you have... You you still have your wand. You still have your, yeah. your stuff. You have all your stuff. All my stuff? Yes. Uh, you do not have... I do have all my stuff. Yes. Do not have. Uh, you do have. You do have all your stuff. Of all my stuff. Yes. I say, hey MacArthur, do you remember when I was going to cut your dick off in the other room? Uh, no. You can forget something like that. <laughs> have me <be> back here. <laughs> okay. Last thing I remember, we were shooting dinosaurs. Well, clearly, MacArthur and Rod are victims of the Nexus event and need to be um, need to undergo full medical examinations at a facility with the, the appropriate equipment. There's nothing that's wrong my medical, with me. That's my medical opinion. There's nothing wrong with me. I think you guys are just a little bit, have too much anxiety, man. You guys need to calm down, go have a beer, yeah, I'm good. relax. It's also company policies. <laughs> Whenever you've been mirrored, I have check been out. mirrored. Why do you keep saying that? <laughs> I'm normal. Well, we all know that's not true. It is. Trust me. <laughs> All we gotta do is look at the video of you right now. There's nothing normal. Very normal. Is it jealous? That's what I, I submitted my report to Ted that I think that MacArthur and Rod need to undergo thorough thorough medical exam. <laughs> So they, should, they need to comply because it's company policy. Okay. The leader would know if it's company policy. And uh, true. Yeah. Probably they should be sent for like two months of psychiatric evaluation. Three. <laughs> Four even. Too much time. I got other things to do. So, you guys are just gonna have to believe me that I'm normal. So Ted, what are your what are your orders for the team? Well, I think um, this is actually a really good spot to stop. Okay. Because uh, I don't think Ted will want to send you back without further understanding what's going on in this Nexus event. Uh, and we've got all your team members. You've obviously lost equipment. That was fun. And we <laughs> will, uh, we'll, 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 we'll stop this game here, knowing that we can pick up this area. We can go back at any time in the future 
But okay. uh, that's a good, this is a really good place to hold off. Well, that was Multiversal Mayhem, second episode of Multiversal Trippers, when one universe ain't enough. Hope you enjoyed that. You made it all the way to here. So, hey, either you're skipping ahead or you watch the whole thing. I'm going to pretend you watch the whole thing. Hit that subscribe button and don't forget, likey, likey, and share. Until next time, this is Professor Brian David Phillips saying, live trance and prosper. Bye-bye.